What's up, YouTube? Welcome to Shiny's World. I'm back with another bag. I'm trying to knock out some reaction videos, but unfortunately, the internet is acting stupid. But uh, make sure you guys like, comment, and subscribe. Make sure you hit that post notification bell. Subscribe, subscribe, subscribe. Like, spam up the comments. Period. I was going to do some more reactions, like I said, but um, internet's acting stupid. So once this this side, it want to kick in and do its thing, then I will um, knock out more reactions. But in the meantime, between time, I thought I'd do this uh, shoe review. The only shoes that I just got, like, um, when did these come out? I think these came out last Friday. I think they came out last week sometime i think it was friday it's been i've been busy <laughs> but um i got them for finish line i'm not trying to promote nothing but uh i got them for finish line oh actually one of them off for raffle again um then i was actually asking a guy um i asked him about the raffles and like how it worked and stuff and he was like um you don't always win the raffle because he did the raffle and he didn't win. So you don't always win a raffle. But if you keep doing a raffle and you win a raffle and you come pick up your shoes, um, nine times out of ten, I guess, like once you do start doing the raffles, you will get them automatically. So it, it has been some shoes or it is some shoes coming out that I want to get, but I ain't going to be able to get because... um. I'm going on a trip, so I'm trying to save for that. But um, we just wanted to show you guys these shoes. Um, these are the Jordan 5 Retros, the Fresh Prince Bel Air. Um, the fives come in these type of boxes. Um, but you guys, didn't, I know you guys ain't here to see the box, but we're in the five just in case anybody wanna, you know what I mean? Do that, but. Hold it up like this. Um, uh, this is different. This paper is uh, I don't know what kind of paper this is. It feel like a uh, plastic bag, basically. But yeah, I don't know why they. But let me take them out the box. First off, let me see if this internet decided it wanted to kick in or something because i'm trying to knock out a bunch of reaction videos for y'all but so give y'all a little quick review real quick these are the fresh prints bear lair look at that get a close look up on them These are so dope, y'all. If you didn't cop these, it's probably too late. They probably, when I got them, they were 190. And um, they're probably like four or $500 now. Maybe even more. So. And I haven't copped a fit for these yet. I'm not even, I ain't gonna take the shoe strings out. I ain't gonna do none of that because they just, they so dope. So, this here, it, it's just, it feels like the, uh, if you have any um, Air Force Ones, this is what it kind of feel like. It's nothing spectacular about that. Uh, I just, I love the colors. Like, it's so many different colors in it. And that's what I like about it. Got the purple, got the lime green, it got the, um, it got pink and then it got like splats in it, which is like a teal color. I don't know if you can see that. Let's see. It's like a teal color. And then they got the lime green and the purple coming back across. And then they got the little splat right there too. And then this right here, it's uh this up underneath a like a clear coated like under the bottom this i like how they did the whole design 
Um, then the shoestrings, that's obviously black, which it gave you some extra uh, shoestrings, which is green, which I might throw these in there because I don't know how I feel about the black shoestrings. You know, I might rock the black sho shoestrings one time, but I think I might throw some different colors. Like you could throw the lime green, green like which I have, or you could do pink. You can even do purple, white maybe. I don't think I'll do white. But it's a history with this shoe. If you haven't seen the show, it's Fresh Prince Bear Lair. Obviously, all, you know, back in the day, people wore Jordans and stuff like that. And they, they're now coming back out with the same Jordans that they did back in the day. That's why I said I used to have all the Jordans. Like, back in the day, I used to have all the Jordans. But um, as time went on like you know me moving and stuff constantly or whatever or not um they might have got thrown away i might have sold them so it's like now i'm trying to get my collection back up but i really like these i really fell in love with the colors that's what did it for me is the colors nothing spectacular i mean the i like how that's all in the shoe you see it that's all in the shoe and then you just got the black sole down there with the if you can see the jordan symbol down there and then i like how this is i don't know what it's called but this right here it's like a tie oh, i guess you don't have to tie your shoes up you can use that but, but yeah i basically fell in love with the colors like I said, it's nothing spectacular about it. It's just the colors. That's what's really basically popping. And then, you know, this just, it feels like, this is kind of like an air bubble right down the side. But um, I feel like if these shoes get dirty, like somebody step on them, they're easy to clean just because of the material, I think. Um... And then you got the the little clear here. It's like a little vented area to breathe. Oh, they actually have them on both sides. Um, nothing really spectacular about the bottom. Um, I do like the colors, the line. I like the colors because they just they pop. And you got the Jordan symbol, obviously. Gotta gotta have a Jordan symbol. And then they got the Jordan symbol up there, which see the colors are just popping. That's what that's what's bringing this shoe out, the colors. That's what's basically bringing this shoe out is the colors. Oh, I never had any fives, retro fives. I never had any retro fives. This is my first pair of retro fives. So, like I said, I want to get my shoe collection back up there, and um, I think overall I will probably get this shoe. I would probably rate this shoe at eight. Just because I don't like the shoestring colors. And I really don't like how this is. Like, I feel like this could have been better. But like I said, it's the colors that did it. Like, you don't even recognize any of the stuff. You just look at the colors like, damn, that's dope. So, just wanted to do a shoe review on these. I'm going to get it again for you guys quick little review on them like i said got the um <clears throat> lime green shoestrings which was dope you don't have to buy any shoestrings let me know um if you guys are liking the shoe reviews that i do um spam up the comments smash the like buttons And that's it. That's what that's it with this. Um before I end this video, make sure you like, comment, and subscribe down below. Make sure you hit that post notification bell. I'm trying to hit a thousand subscribers. You guys are you guys are awesome right now. I'm at 288, so that means I'm I'm doing something good. You feel me? But um spam up the comments, smash the like button, and until then, peace. <laughs>